Hi, today we're going to see how to create a color splash effect in Photo P. So the first thing we need to do is to add the new adjustment layer, a hue and saturation adjustment layer. So left click here. And now select hue and saturation. Make sure on the move tool. And now left click here on the sample hue. So here are settings I'm using, source all layers, sample size one by one. So I uncheck the sample ring and zoom in. And now you need to select the color you want to keep from your image or layer. So I want to keep the red color, so left click. Now I'm going to bring the saturation slider all the way down. So now, as you can see, it desaturated the bus here, but it also desaturated the castle here. So if I make my window here shorter, smaller. So if I click on the eye icon here to see the before and after. So here's the before and here's after. So now I'm going to zoom out, select the zoom tool, right click zoom out and now i'm going to select the hand tool I'm going to move it here so we can see the whole layer let's select the move tool and now we are still on the hue saturation layer and now i'm going to move these two points here these two sliders here I'm going to move them to the blue so for example i'm going to move this one here so as you can see it reduces saturation of the layers of the elements in our layer so now i'm going to move this one too so you just need after that to play with the sliders and now for these handles here i'm going to move them to the color that i sampled so for example i moved them to the right so here as you can see it's revealing our red color but it's also revealing the other colors so if i left click here select the zoom tool now let's select the hand tool so as you can see it revealed the color of the bus but also the persons here so now, for example, I'm going to leave it here. So now I just need to turn into black and white the rest and leave the bus. So now I'm going to click on this here to hide my window. So let's zoom. So now I'm going to add the black and white adjustment layer. So left click here and then select black and white. So here it is. I'm going to hide this one. So it turned everything to into black and white. And now I'm going to invert this raster mask. You can either go to image, adjustments, and then invert, or just select the raster mask and then hold the control key and then press I. And now in order to reveal our black and white layer, I just need to paint with white on the raster mask on the places where I want to change into black and white. So select the brush tool, make sure the foreground color is white. So for the size, I'm going to increase it a little bit. So I think I'm going to leave it with this one. It's, it's enough. So here are settings, hardness 100%, opacity 100, and flow 100. And now I'm just going to paint with white on my raster mask on places I want to turn into black and white. So here, for example. So here it is. This one here, this one. Going to increase a little bit size, I think. So here like this, and now I'm going to paint this. So I think here I'm okay. So now I'm going to create a new layer from what's visible on the canvas. So hold the control key, the alt key and the shift key, and then press E. So here it is. Now I'm going to hide these two layers, these two adjustment layers. And now let's see the before and the after. So here it is. That's how you can create a color splash effect in Photopea. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day and uh, till next time.